This is going to treat the fascia anterior to the sacrum. So the first thing I'm going to have the patient do is I'm going to, in a second, he's going to lift up his legs, but I'm going to place my hand underneath the sacrum so his sacrum is going to be resting on my hand. Thank you. Come back down. Good. And then straighten your legs out for me. And then I'm going to use the heel of my hand to come down and find his pubic symphysis. And when I get to his pubic symphysis, I'm going to go just superior to his pubic symphysis. And I'm going to assess motion in the lateral direction. Superior and inferior. And counterclockwise, clockwise. So because this is a myofascial release, I can treat it either directly or indirectly. So I can take him into the planes that he does not like to go for a direct or into the ones that he does like to go for an indirect. And then we will hold this there for 30 seconds. I can, I'm also, as I'm assessing this motion, when I was assessing the motion, I was feeling what was happening based on my hand that's underneath the sacrum so I could feel what was happening in the fascia. seconds and then I'm going to reassess planes of motion and that has resolved. Can you lift up for me? Thanks.